specifications call for these to be 75 to 85 uh, foot pounds of torque. And I have a torque wrench that measures in Newton meters. So for an 80, that, transform, that, that uh, translates into a 108 Newton meter. So, torquing down the flywheel to 108 Newton meters. I think that was all of them. Here you go. Hold it. Hold the motor. Yes. Yeah. Hold it. I'm gonna get on the. I'm gonna get on the back side. Put the clock on. Let's get on that. Hold up. Can we do it? You can get on up there when I can, yeah. Okay. I need a, just need a two to four block there right here where I move it easy. Boom. Pick up high as it goes. See, it's got gold with that in. Yeah. Wait a minute. I'm going to have to let it down. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hey. Huh? I need to take. Okay, sorry. I uh, hadn't done an update all along. These are our inner fenders. They are coated with glossy black 415. Look good. Underside is treated with, I don't know if you can see that. I can't. Uh, bed liner. Got our 351 installed. I'm still working on the water pump. I don't have all my bolts, but uh, gaskets are on there. I got to put a little bit more sealing in there and then put it on. Uh, plugs in. Ended up taking the manifolds off because one of them back here wasn't, it, I, we think we're going to have a leak right there. It wasn't mat, mating up good enough. You know, I had it torqued down good. We're going to take it back to the machine shop and let him mill the, the surface so that they, so that they, uh, sorry about that, so they go all the way around. But it wasn't mating here or here. And I'm lying to you because it's on the other side. Um, anyway, you get the idea. Flywheel over here. Let me take something really dumb. Uh, and I did it. Put the torque converter in the bell housing and then mated it up with the, uh, tried to mate it up with the engine, but I forgot about the bolts that connect the torque converter to the flywheel. So if you can see, these marks here and here. Oh, here's a good one. Here. We didn't, uh, we shouldn't even think about that. So, tried to put it together, got one of the bolts started, put the flywheel in a bind, and warped it. Can't tell it here, but it did. What you, are you I got a surprise egg. A prize egg. And know what's inside? What is that? It's an egg. Inside some Play-Doh? Yeah. Okay. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. It's a Play-Doh mold. What is that? Pickles? I'm going to make you a winner in. Okay. Make me another one. My mom is going to rock the Play-Doh. Okay. I love you. All right, so anyway, that kind of, that's kind of, oh, here, I have, oh man, I don't know if you can tell this at all or not, oh, there we go, um, bed liner spray on these fender aprons, so, they had some tar stuff on them, I couldn't get all that off without tearing them up, so, I just coated over them, they'll be fine once they go on there. Last thing for the day, I'm going to try to get the drive shaft put in.
All right, I just kind of got this one a little bit more than finger tight. See if I can back it up, turn it around the other side. Oh, it's heavy. Dropping something. All right, let's see. That'll work, maybe. Oh yeah, look at there. I'll show you what I got from the Mexican. Actually, I think it's a Guatemalan uh, grocery store. But they're plantain chips, kind of like banana. Um, they're good. Try them. All right, I'm gonna get a wrench on this. Be right back. Okay, so wife said it's time to shut her down and eat supper. Got that one done. Hey, your eyes. Still got that one to go. Got my. Uh, Yoke back here. This is the last one. New one installed. This is the last one, Daddy. There you go. Oh, is that the last one? Okay. I'm watching. Next, when I get these fenders, inner fenders done, and we'll start breaking off that uh, radiator support and all the housing for the front. I'm going to lose that grill. Oh, what you got? Oh, yeah. Acorn tops. Love it. Ready to go? One more for me. 